Hi, if you're like me, you know 1969's Battle of Britain is one of the greatest movies of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun if you pulled up a chair by the campfire and watch it again with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023. Okay, let's see together. Air Vice Marshal Keith Park is played by actor Trevor Howard. He was 56 years old when filming in 1969, and sadly, on January 7, 1988, he passed away at the age of 74 in Arkley, London, England. All right, Canfield, what's up? You have a pilot mission. Yes, sir. Over the channel. Uh, test ground. Uh, when Alec Clunes was uh, very upset that I didn't put him on the bowl, he was a slow tweaker. And of course, I, I didn't want to upset. Squad leader Ken Field is played by actor Michael Caine. In 1969 when filming, he was 36 years old, and now he's living a healthy life at the age of 90. How much longer, Ops? The engine's overheating and so am I. We either stand down or blow up. Which do you want? I had a friend down there, Jack Nicholson, who I'd never worked with, and he brought me a script, Blood and Wine, and he, he sort of talked me into going back to work. Air Chief Marshal Hugh Dowding is played back to Lawrence Olivier. In 1969 when filming, he was 62 years old, and sadly on July 11, 1989, he passed away at the age of 82 in Staining, West Sussex, England. It's that our young men will have to shoot down their young men at the rate of 4 to 1, if we're to keep pace at all. It was Brandon. First time I'd ever seen him. I think it was the first time anybody had ever seen him. And very shortly after that, his qualities were discovered, needless to, to say, I mean. Baron von Richter is played back to Kurt Jurgens. In 1969 when filming, he was 54 years old, and sadly on June 18, 1982, he passed away at the age of 66 in Vienna, Austria. Flattened London as a prelude to invasion. It's two lumps you take, isn't it? What's left of your army? Abandoned its weapons. Ich noch keine Idee davon, dass ich jemals Schauspieler werden würde. Und da hatte ich ein Vorbild. Das war Thomas Mann. Da wollte ich immer Schriftsteller werden. Und da hatte ich äh, wirklich Träume davon. Air Vice Marshal Evo is played back to Michael Redgrave. In 1969, when filming, he was 61 years old, and sadly on March 21st, 1985, he passed away at the age of 77 in Denham, Buckinghamshire, England. Three from Army Cooperation. It's a uh... 30, is it? Not enough, Evel. We lost that many yesterday. And the air staff hesitate to weaken the light bomb. But um, what happened was that um, I ran on from the side and burst into... Surgeon pilot Andy is played by actor Ian McShane. In 1969 when filming, he was 27 years old, and now he's living out his life at the age of 80. I'll get your left. I'd rather walk, sir. Cut out the sir. You want to be attractive. Yeah, well, all they think we're sexy. idiots, you know, the politicians. They all sit around. But it's a good charity. It's a shame it's been cancelled. I mean, that's a, it does right. that as well, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. That's what it's for. Squad leader Colin Harvey is played back to Christopher Plummer. In 1969, when filming, he was 40 years old. And sadly, on February 5th, 2021, he passed away at the age of 91 in Western Connecticut, USA. Only a third of a one, sir. Oh, that's better than nothing. I used to blast away and never hit a sausage. <laughs> one thing, though. What's that, sir? <laughs> yes. Is that a laugh of, no, that's not true? No, it was... It was... Or, yes, that is true? Absolutely. I, don't, I can't quite remember how it started, but... The, of course the, you can't. The... <laughs> Group Captain Baker is played back to Kenneth Moore. In 1969, he was 55 years old. And sadly, on July 12, 1982, he passed away at the age of 67 in Fulham, London, England. I've noticed that some of your girls are now using the men's trenches during air raid practice. It's got to stop. Sir. Hmm. And another thing, gas mask cases. Always had somebody, and you'll always make somebody very happy. I didn't want to do it. A lot of my friends tapped me on the back in the Gallic Club and said, Come on, Kenny, it's about time you wrote it now. And so I went ahead and did it. I didn't want to. Section Officer Maggie Harvey is played by actress Susanna York. In 
In 1969, when filming, she was 30 years old, and sadly, on January 15, 2011, she passed away at age of 72 in Brompton, London, England. You applied for that post in Scotland? Darling, I can't. You can't? You know I can't. You mean you don't want to? Can't! I've got to... Um, um, and there's so many good ones. Um, they, they just, they're just people. They're people. But is, was he a generous performer? I mean, yes. Yeah. Yes. Sir David Kelly's play back to Ralph Richardson. In 1969 when filming, he was 67 years old, and sadly on October 10, 1983, he passed away at the age of 80 in London, England. Oh, then. Their embassy in London gives you two weeks. So what's stopping you? So, well, I think so, yes. There are lots of reasons that people become actors. Some to hide themselves and some to show themselves. But uh... a senior civil servant is played back to Harry Andrews. He was 58 years old in 1969, and sadly on March 6, 1989, he passed away at the age of 77 in Selhurst, Sussex, England. The French have been promised these quadrants by Churchill personally. He's given the French Prime Minister his word. Group Captain Hope is played by actor Nigel Patrick. In 1969 when filming, he was 57 years old, and sadly on September 21st, 1981, he passed away at the age of 69 in London, England. It'll be a pain in the neck to the enemy when he comes. It's the joker up our sleeves. Now, the RDF chain shows us where they are. The information is passed to group, group scramble. Squad leader Skipper is played by actor Robert Shaw. In 1969, he was 42 years old, and sadly, on August 28, 1978, he passed away at the age of 51 in Tormacaddy, County Mayo, Ireland. Got to do better than that, right? Well, five are write-offs. One has an undercar gone, and two are missing, sir. Mr. Anthony and Sergeant Moore. Mm -hmm. Let me know who's your favorite character from the movie Battle of Britain and share your thoughts on the actors who have passed away by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.